The New World, Puro Especial by AJ Fernandez. Hello, my name is Gavin Bertram, also known as Smoker McGavin, and we're here to do another exciting cigar review. I chose this cigar today because it's about midday, and this is apparently is a medium-bodied smoke. That's at least what it says on the internet. So we will get into it and see if I chose wisely. I will say, it smells very delicious, it smells like just like a farm, very earthy. The wrapper seems a little bit rugged, but even. This is the Toro size, it has a nice double cap. I gotta say, it looks delicious, smells delicious. So let's get it cut up and start smoking. Okay, off the first light, I'm getting a very strong oil slick, a little bit of cedar, a little bit of wood. Let me see. Very oily. I would say an oily coffee off the first light with a little bit of cedariness. Oily coffee cedariness. Well, let's keep smoking. I'll get back in touch with you guys during the first third. Okay, so we're about 14 minutes into, so far, a fantastic medium-bodied cigar. So far, I seem to have chosen my flavors wisely. We'll see if the nicotine ramps up. So far, I don't feel any, which is fine by me, because I generally like to have lots of flavor and low nicotine. As you can see, the burn is flawless. No complaints there. Flavor profile, I'm getting like a sweet chocolate with cedar coffee and an oily mouth slick. Very good flavors so far. I hope it continues to perform nicely. Some information about this cigar. This is the New World Puro Especial, so it's actually the third in the New World line. First was the AJ Fernandez New World, then there was the New World Connecticut, and now this one. So this is a Puro, so that means it uses all tobaccos from the same nation. This nation being Nicaragua, specifically farms owned by the AJ Fernandez family. Apparently it was blended by AJ Fernandez and his father. It was originally released as a special edition, you know, short-term release. It got really good reviews, so now he released it as a, a more prominent blend. Anyway, we're gonna keep smoking and I'll get back in touch with you guys during the second third. Okay, so we're 43 minutes into this fantastic cigar. I would say it's come up a little bit in body. Some puffs are more of like a medium full than a medium, but so far I would say still a medium. Only a few puffs have, have seemed like a medium full. The flavors I'm getting are sweet chocolate, coffee, a little bit of nut, and then a long cedary finish. Before it was like a sweet chocolate, now it's it's a more of a dark chocolate. I personally really like dark chocolate and coffee. The cedariness goes well with the nut on the finish. It's uh, like a nutty, chocolatey coffee. So I'm gonna keep puffing away on this cigar and I'll get back in touch with you guys during the third third. Okay, so we're about one hour, 36 minutes in. I'm gonna wrap this up in just a few minutes, so I'll go ahead and say the smoke time was about an hour and 40 minutes. The third third flavors have been more or less the same from the second third, but I will say in the third third, it took on a full bodied flavor profile much darker notes, much more full flavors. The coffee was in the second third, but I would say it's more of a dark coffee. The chocolate was in the second third, and it was a dark chocolate in the second third, but now it's even more dark. Final thoughts, I would say this cigar has a very good bang for your buck value. You can get them for $8 in a tobacco shop, and even cheaper if you buy them online in bulk. It's interesting because it started out as a good medium and it ended as a full. So kind of followed me throughout my afternoon. Fantastic cigar. When it comes to performance, I just got a little bit of a wonky burn at the very, very end here, but throughout the whole cigar, it performed beautifully. Draw was perfect. Burn was perfect. Didn't have to touch it up once. Ash has been coming off in solid inch clumps. Definitely give this cigar a try. I would say it's probably my favorite of the three New World cigars. Anyway, I'm going to finish this up. Enjoy your smoke, people.